Christians, um, saints, God bless you. This is Kamala, and the Lord has put something on my heart that um, all he who have not come to Christ yet, um, no one knows the day or hour, but the signs are falling in place that it is the season for the return of Jesus. And um, he's coming with the sword of truth, the word of God. So it is time to repent and to ask Jesus to be Lord and Savior of your life. And last night he gave me this book, um, Obadiah. It's a small book in the Bible, one page, but it's a vision that has a lot of meaning to it. <clears throat> and I couldn't help but um, see the uh, parallel between the United States and the terrorist attack of radical Islam against us in this book. Um, of Obadiah as a vision and um, hopefully it will just be able to see have someone see it too and to bring them to the Lord I think I was about 12 when I made this connection um, so I hope you'll be able to make it too and come to Jesus so I'm going to read it now the vision of Obadiah thus saith the Lord God concerning Edom we have heard a rumor from the Lord, and an ambassador is sent among the heathen. Arise ye, and let us rise up against her in battle. Behold, I have made thee small among the heathen. Thou art greatly despised. Is not America greatly despised amongst many countries? The pride of thine heart hath deceived thee. Thou that dwellest in the clefts of the rock, whose habitation is high, that saith in his heart, Who shall bring me down to the ground? Though thou exalt thyself as thy eagle, excuse me, though thou exalt thyself as the eagle, and though thou set thy nest among the stars, thence will I bring thee down, saith the Lord. Is not the bald eagle the symbol of America? It is. Do not we exalt ourselves? as the greatest nation in the world. Don't we have a vanity about that, um, that we are um, completely untouchable by the rest of the world? If thieves came to thee, if robbers by night, but thou art cut off, would they not have stolen till they had enough? If the grape gatherers came to thee, would they not have some grapes? How are the things of Esso searched out how are his hidden things sought up all the men of thy confederacy have brought thee even to the border the men that were at peace with thee have deceived thee and prevailed against thee they that eat thy bread laid a wound under thee there is none understanding in him shall i not in that day saith the lord even destroy the wise men out of edom an understanding out of the mount of Esso. And thy mighty men, O Teman, shall be dismayed to the end that every one of the mount of Esso may be cut off by slaughter. For thy violence against thy brother Jacob, shame, shall cover thee, and thou shalt be cut off forever. In the day that thou stoodest on the other side, in the day that the strangers carried away captive his forces, and foreigners entered into his gates, and cast lots upon Jerusalem, even thou wast as them one of them. But thou shouldest not have looked on the day of thy brother, in the day that he became a stranger, neither shouldest thou have rejoiced over the children of Judah in the day of their destruction, neither shouldest thou have spoken proudly in the day of distress. Thou shouldest not have entered into the gate of my people in the day of their calamity. Yea, thou shouldest not have looked on their affliction in the day of their calamity, nor have laid hands on their substance in the day of their calamity. Neither shouldest thou have stood in the crossway to cut off those that did not escape. Neither shouldest thou have delivered up those of his that did remain in the day of distress. For the day of the Lord is near upon all the heathen, as thou hast done. It shall be done unto thee. 
thy reward shall return upon thine own head. For ye, as ye have drunk upon my holy mountain, so shall all the heathen drink continually. Yea, they shall drink, and they shall swallow down, and they shall be as though they had not been. But upon Mount Zion shall be deliverance, and there shall be holiness, and the house of Jacob shall possess their possessions. And the house of Jacob shall be fire, shall be a fire, and the house of Joseph a flame, and the house of Esso for stubble, and they shall kindle in them and devour them, and there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esso, for the Lord hath spoken it. And they of the south shall possess the mount of Esso, and they of the plain the Philistines, and they that possess the fields of Ephraim, and the fields of Samaria and Benjamin shall possess Gilead. And the captivity of this host of the children of Israel shall possess that of the Canaanites, even unto Zariapath. Sorry if I didn't pronounce that one right. And the captivity of Jerusalem, which is Sepharad, shall possess the cities of the south. And saviors shall come up on Mount Zion to judge the Mount of Esso, and the kingdom shall be the Lord's. So for me, it's just a very strong reminder that everything that happens is happening for a reason and that Jesus is the only way. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. The peace of God to you all.